Stewart Alternative Elementary School is under new leadership after Principal Kimberly Jones resigned April 27th. She's accused of paying just 40 cents for lunches for each of her two children. Documents obtained by NBC4 show that from 2009 to 2011, Jones's daughter received $548 in benefits. Her son got $661.50 in benefits. That's a total of $1,251.75. Added prior balances from 2008, and Jones owes Columbus City Schools $1,302. I contacted school board president Carol Perkins about this situation and how it reflects on Columbus City Schools. She says at this time it would be inappropriate for her to comment because the investigation is still pending. However, board member Stephanie Gross did respond to my request and she says situations like this reflect poorly on the district and erode public trust. I went to Kimberly Jones's Linwood Avenue home for a comment. However, my knocks went unanswered. So how could this happen? I got a copy of the free and reduced lunch program application and nowhere on the form is documentation of income such as a pay stub is required for submission. Just a signature and a person's word. And it's that signature, says Franklin County Prosecutor Ron O'Brien, that's enough to bring felony charges against Kimberly Jones. They are subject to prosecution for a combination of either uh, theft by deception or falsification in connection with the commission of a theft offense. NBC4 also received documentation that most of the money has already been repaid to the school system. Besides possibly facing a fifth-degree felony charge, Kimberly Jones could lose her license to teach in the state of Ohio. Ultimately, that decision will be made by the State Board of Education. In Columbus, Candace Lee, NBC4.